Welcome to our makeup tutorial. We're going to show you how to do a pirate technique with makeup you can find almost anywhere around Halloween, including some of your local Goodwills. Here are a few things you'll need for this look. Blendable brown, black, and dark red, tan blush or bronzer, a black eyeliner pencil, black eyeshadow, a small brush, a medium brush, a blush brush, an eyebrow brush, a stipple sponge, cotton swabs, a sponge, and tooth black. Use a sponge and the blendable brown to blend under the cheekbones, then apply and blend at the temples, along the bridge of the nose, and around the chin. Take your small brush and blendable black, then apply along the lower lash line and blend slightly downward. Next apply a thick line on the upper lid and blend towards the crease. Use your medium brush and black eyeshadow to create a smoky layer. Apply over the blendable color above and below the eye and fan out gently. Use your small brush and the dark red to draw the shape of your desired scar. In this example, we're using a Y. After the dark red, use the same brush to trace the outer upper lines with the dark brown to create depth. Next, take a cotton swab with a little dark brown and start a loose shadow outline around the Y, starting about a quarter inch away from the original line. Make sure you blend outward away from the Y as you go. This creates depth and makes a raised scar effect. If you want to create a scar with some stitching, you can use a similar process. Use your small brush and the dark red to draw the line of your scar. Use the same brush to trace the outer upper line with the dark brown. Next, use the small brush with dark brown to draw a few vertical stitches. Trace these lines on the left with the blendable black or dark red. Take a cotton swab with some dark brown to draw a loose shadow outline about a quarter inch away from the scar and blend outward only. Add some bronzer to the forehead, cheeks, nose and chin for a seaworthy tan. Then use the black eyeliner pencil to enhance the eyebrows and brush through with an eyebrow brush. For a little extra interest, dry your teeth and paint on some tooth black to create some rot or even black out a few. Next, use your stipple sponge and alternate between dabbing some brown and black lightly along the skin where stubble might grow. Add your pirate gear of choice and you're ready to set sail. Check out your local Goodwill and see what you can create and visit goodwill.org slash Halloween for more Halloween inspiration.